This is QuickTime Technology and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how to download a text editor called JEdit. So without further ado, let us start the video. Okay, the first thing you have to do is go to your dock, go to your web browser, Safari. Now type in JEdit download on a Mac and click the first link and then we can click the Mac OS X package. downloading jedit and it will start in one two seconds okay click on this double click that minimize this opening jedit dmg file so now we can click on the jedit application and drag it to the applications close out of this eject the installer package and now we can go to our launch pad Click on JEdit, but it will say JEdit app can't be opened because it is from an unidentified developer. But don't worry, click OK, go to System Preferences, go to Security and Privacy, go to General, and it says JEdit was blocked. So we can just do Open anyway and go to Open. So it says Error. Go back to JEdit, and it keeps saying Error. So now go back to Safari. So if we go back to the website, it says, beware from 10.8 on your Mac, will tell you that JEdit is damaged. So when we open the file, we found out that it says it cannot be opened and you should move it to the trash. This is not true though. This is a new security feature called Gatekeeper that allows apps from app stores or signed by certificate issued by Apple for 100 US dollars per year to allow JEdit to run either lower your security settings in system preferences and allow all apps to run control control or right click jedit app and choose open as soon as jedit was run once mac os x forgets about its downloaded state and allows it to run normally so now we have to download free java download in order for this to work agree and start the free download double click this Click this, open, put in my password, install, no, let this install, close, okay that has installed, close this, close this, close this and eject this. So now when we go to jedit, it should run, okay. So close this. That's it for this video. I'll see you guys in the next tutorial. Thanks for now.